Hello and welcome. In this video, I am going to discuss the prerequisite before taking Job Skillshare Cloud Administration program. When we mention program, it's basically coaching services where you are able to meet the professionals in a Discord, which is a platform where you can collaborate with professionals and they will guide you on what courses or what labs to take step by step. And after when you finish everything, they will be able to help you with the resume and also give you references, which is very powerful when you actually go out and start looking for jobs. And not only that, you're in a platform where you're always able to ask questions and they will be able to give you the answers using collaboration tools such as Discord. So before our members take on this program, we have set a prerequisite because it's important for our members to know how we are going to teach uh, the material and what is our expectation. So if you scroll down on this page, you see that there is download content details. If you open the details uh, right here, we have everything uh, given like what this program, the basics of this, the description. But when you come to a uh, basically this section where it says lab guides covered in phase one, Phase one is basically a lab that is more than 40 hours worth of hands-on practice. Now, in that lab, you are going to come across uh, materials and terms such as networking, infrastructure, public, virtualization, and things like that. So, uh, of course, uh, this is something that uh, when we are going to teach this type of material, we expect that you already know what is a network or what is a domain network, what is Active Directory, what is virtualization, what is a server. We are not going to teach uh, that sort of fundamental in cloud learning. Because in reality, the cloud administration positions um, are usually mostly hybrid. When I say hybrid, it's a company that are using their own network that's been there for years and they went to cloud. And that administrator is working with both technologies at the same time. It is uh, very rare to find companies that are 100% cloud. Now, that doesn't mean that there is no uh, company out there that's not 100%. There are many companies, but at some time, you will feel like you're lacking that skills, even if you are inside the cloud platform. For example, creating IP addresses for some sort of application, even in the cloud, you still need to know about IP networking and how uh, you need to give or an assign uh, a set of uh, uh, you know addresses. Now, it's same way you go to firewall rules and other things, very basic stuff. Maybe, maybe even in the cloud, you have to create maybe an Active Directory or something like that. Still, you have to come across all of that learning that we expect you uh, as an engineer or administrator. And that is not something a lot of people will teach you if they are going to teach cloud material uh, from uh, this level. All right, let's talk about the prerequisite. And when we create a prerequisite for a program, we basically take the most realistic approach that is currently in the market. Now, when you go to Indeed.com and you type cloud administrator job titles, you're going to come across different type of job titles, such as cloud administrator, then cloud systems administrator. And even if it says IT systems administrator, it may have some sort of cloud technical operations. And this may also be a normal generic title like systems network administrator, but it will be more focused to our cloud um, uh, uh, features as well. Uh, by going down, you probably will find more like cloud uh, Azure cloud administrator, AWS cloud administrator. You're going to find many titles like that. But most of the descriptions are going to come uh, across uh, basically Linux, uh, AWS, Azure administration, um, virtualization and cloud, all of that um, basic level administration is going to be a part of your job um, skills. And uh, basically, we don't want to confuse you with DevOps uh, administration because that's a different field. And even though some of the cloud administration positions may uh, come across some of the DevOps tools, and that is okay, we're going to cover some of it as well. So you will be also um, uh, confident on that type of tools, but we're not making you a DevOps engineer or DevOps administrator at this point. That's a different field uh, than just a normal cloud administrator positions.
So you can see that most of these jobs are, are going to be very highly paid jobs. And of course, this is not uh, designed for anybody who have uh, uh, entry level skills. Uh, we don't expect that, and that's why there's a prerequisite. So let's talk about the prerequisite for JSS member in JSS uh, platform. So let's talk about the prerequisite for JSS premium members. Now, when you click on roadmaps, uh, if you are a new student starting from scratch, then of course you can't apply to this program because you need to finish the modern IT support career roadmap. And this will have three uh, courses that you have to finish. And basically, this type of course is uh, it's the foundation to almost everything, like DHCP, DNS, operating systems, Active Directory, Office 365. These are important skills that are going to get you started. And then the most important course for you to transition to the cloud administration skills is to finish transitioning skills roadmap. Basically, what this is, it will teach you networking and systems administration skills. Even though we have a different program for this, that's something you don't have to take if you're going for cloud administration. Um, but you can finish this program uh, by self-paced manner by coming as a member. You just click on it and then finish the material inside the course. So let's go into the course and talk about what you should focus on. If you already have a lot of networking knowledge and systems administration knowledge, this will be very easy for you to just go over and just uh, finish the things that you probably have not touched. So if you're new to networking and systems administration, I highly recommend you go over this course fully. But of course, you can, uh, you know, you don't have to go too deep into switching and routing because that may not be used as a cloud administrator. But going over certain things really help you because if you are going to become a administrator in a hybrid world or hybrid corporate business then maybe they may have a lot of networking set up they may have their own team by the way so you don't have to really worry about it but knowing is always a good thing right you know you may come across similar type of uh you know uh, um, technologies or features even in cloud and then you will really like that you have went through all of this information and things will make sense to you you just have to learn what cloud uh, is offering you in terms of the same technologies that we're using, just maybe through the browser, through the CLI and things like that, it's really gonna help you. So this course is a definitely a prerequisite for our members. Uh, uh, you know, if you wanna take that course and be comfortable uh, with, a, with the trainers doing the labs and when you're going through that course, it's really gonna help you. Again, our cloud administration program or any other programs are 100% self-paced. You don't have to come to live sessions or anything. We give you tasks. The trainers are there in the Discord. You will finish the task. They will run reports on each Monday, and then you can collaborate with them, ask them questions, and through the communication tools, they will be able to give you the answer. So there's no need for you to be uh, available at certain times. You can do another job or work, and you can do this program uh, on your own time, on your own pace. Registration process is very simple. You'll go to jobsclashare.org, click on membership, in your membership scroll down and here's the third program available on the membership page you will click on learn more and once you go over all of these details uh, go ahead and click on download content details and you can see what we are going to cover and uh, like i said it's very straightforward you're just gonna enroll yourself by putting this form out here just fill out this form you're going to get the registration links and emails after we verify that everything is good to go and you will be invited to a discord uh, server which is an application and you you will see your trainers there and that's where they're going to assign you uh, work uh, and you will just basically finish it on your own pace you will have almost one year to finish everything but of course we're not going to be doing this throughout the year we're going to set some time to make sure that you uh, finish the course material before your membership expires and that's how you uh, can join our program. If you have any other questions, you can definitely, uh, you know, contact us by coming to on the bottom. You see there's an uh, email, there's a WhatsApp or voicemail available as well. So there are some information available. You can let us know and we will help you out. Thank